So, I brought Aiden over to my place today to start working on his shoulder. He's been doing some of the work that we've done on his own as well. And the goal here primarily is increasing range of motion for his shoulder. Obviously, it's been in a stint for quite some time. And working through various ranges has been the goal. Obviously, the rotator cuff has been my primary focus for him. Basically, it is the reinforcer of the shoulder and it keeps it intact. And to get the AC joint to move the way we want it to is what I was aiming for. So we were doing some pull-aparts today. We have been doing some rows as the lat is a synergist for the joint capsule. We did some external rotations for the infraspinatus, internal rotations for the subscapularis. We did a little, I don't think we did any abductor work today, did we? Primarily, no. No, no. We did some active range of motion work on his back. Like and so. what was our huge victory today? We have moved all the way to touching the floor. Yeah, when so lying on the ground, we're touching the floor now, guys. Elevation of the scapula, and it is an active range for Aiden now, as opposed to having to guide his arm, he's able to work through a full range of motion himself, which is proving week by week he is getting stronger. So we're on the path to potentially adding more resistance, which means weight training and bodybuilding is very close by. And we got this guy to thank. He's our trainer extraordinaire. He's like a human encyclopedia, this I'm, guy. I'm learning along the way just as much. This is a very new project for me, and that Aiden's letting me take it into my hands is really, really cool. We're going to throw up some of Eric's stuff here uh, on screen. You guys can check him out. Just cooking up some food. We're going to have some eggs, bacon. We're going to have some rice cakes. Avocado on the rice cakes, eggs on top of that. A little strip of bacon over top. Delicious meal, you guys. If you're on a diet or you know, you're not trying to eat bread or maybe you've got a gluten intolerance, definitely try rice cakes instead for your avocado toast. Pro tip right there. How good does that look, guys? Pretty amazing. Game changer. All right, guys, so I just got home from work. I thought I'd show you kind of how I'm looking right now. Um, so, you guys, everything is coming back actually really nicely. Like obviously, I'm a lot smaller than I used to be, but it's crazy how fast the body can adjust. Um, I've been working um, back to work for two months now, um, you know, physical work, obviously. So, I'm just doing that and then um, eating properly, like prepping my meals. You know, I've got the abs back, I've got the definition back, chest, you know, it's a little bit of thickness there. Arms, arms are still smaller, but some like vascularity is coming back and like things are actually shaping up really nicely, guys. So muscle memory is a thing. It's actually working really well. Um, obviously, I'm back in the gym now too, which helps, um, but my, uh, my split's a little like easier laid back. It's upper, lower, upper, lower. So I'm working out four, four days a week, but nothing's like super heavy or anything. Um, so, but yeah, guys, like just, just that and I'm seeing so much difference in my body. So it really is a, a, a real thing, the muscle memory. Um, also if you guys care, um, intermittent fasting, I have been since the summertime, um, very religiously. So my window is 11 AM, which is my first break usually at work. And then, uh, I eat till 7 PM at night and I cut it off there. Um, but I definitely attribute the, you know, some of the muscle gain back and, and like leanness and stuff um, from my intermittent fasting. So just so you guys know. What's going on everybody? AJ Bodybuilding here. Um, if you've seen the title of this video, I can assure you that it's not clickbait. Um, so hopefully you, you'll want to listen to what I have to say here. Um, guys, so... This channel has always been something for me uh, to track my progress in bodybuilding, to look back on a lot of memories, um, training with friends, competing. Um, this is something I always wanted to do and something I was very passionate about. Now, as I'm getting older, 
I'm no longer passionate about filming myself doing these things and I wanted to come back after this injury with a new series. I wanted to get back into it and I've just found guys that I'm not into it anymore. I'm not interested, um, just to put it bluntly. Um, and it's hard for me to say, but um, I'm retiring this channel. So here's the thing though. This is not the last you're gonna see of me on YouTube. Um, I have started a channel with my friend, one of my closest friends in the world, Eric Dunnell. You've seen him on the channel many times before. Um, we've started a channel for him. Um, and I am the man behind the camera. I am going to be, I am the one filming and editing all of his videos. And guys, that's what I'm passionate about now. It's not about being in the video anymore for me. It's, I wanna be that guy behind the scenes. I've always been super, super interested in and, and passionate about video editing. Um, I'm not the best at it, but I just love to do it. That's what I always found was super enjoyable in doing these videos too. And I love the fact that I'm not the one being filmed. I love that I can capture Eric in essence because Eric is a fantastic bodybuilder and is so knowledgeable, one of the most knowledgeable guys I know and the strongest guy I've ever met. Um, and so for his, for me to be able to document him now, I, I really, really enjoy that. So um, guys, please, please, if you do want to see what I'm doing now on YouTube or if you want some new, uh, a breath of fresh air in, in bodybuilding content, please do follow Eric's channel, um, our channel. Um, it's Eric Dunnell Training. I'll link it in the uh, info box below, guys. Um, so, so in reality, I mean, I'm, I'm retiring this channel. You won't see any more videos after this one. Um, but I will be, in a way, on YouTube still. And you will see me in the odd video, guys. Like, I will appear in the channel, and I already have. So um, if you guys want to see more of what I'm doing, um, if you guys want to subscribe to an awesome, awesome bodybuilding channel, please do subscribe to our channel, Eric Dunnell training okay um, so guys it's been amazing um, I always had a small small support on this channel but the support I did have and the people I've met over YouTube um, I won't forget it and you guys are all amazing um, you know I still have a lot of you on social media and stuff too uh, so you know we won't lose touch we won't lose touch but but for me, this this channel will be no more. Obviously, I'm gonna keep the, the videos on the channel, um, so you guys will still be able to watch them, and I'll still be able to watch them and relive the memories, but there won't be any new channels, or new videos, sorry. Um, so that's it, guys. Um, I'm gonna wrap this up. I'm going to throw together some of my favorite clips from this channel. Um, some of my favorite clips that I've done, some of my best memories that I still have saved on my computer um, as a little montage, as a little send off. So I hope you guys enjoy that. Thank you guys so much for everything. AJ Bodybuilding was able to, you know, was able to live in a way because some, some of you guys and some people out there, you know, gave a crap about what I had to say and, and my journey. So. I appreciate you guys forever, and um, that's it. AJ Bodybuilding, out for good.
Let's go.